And the champ. Papa! No mercy! And off we go. He's very elusive, you know, and, and I think Magomed has the range. This fight. The coach is over at Tiger Motai. Peter Yan will commit to. And right now, just looking Magomed. And that's what he's looking out for, trying to make sure that Magomed doesn't get in on these takedowns and get it to the mat. Beautiful nice little sweep there, the Thai style first fight as well. And he launches in with an attack, goes to the Thai palm. You know, like you said, fearless is the right word when it comes to Peter Yan. He, PTN ate the punch as he came in, but he's so durable. I think that caused damage. I think that was more just the momentum of the spin. And Magomed, like you said, launching it again with that overhand. Nice little elbow. And they're complaining about a head bang. Throwing everything in. Oh, spinning back fist coming from Magomedov. Well, in the last fight. That feeling out process they had in that first fight. They are wasting no time. From the outside. Again, Again that throw. Gets to the back. Looking for one hook. Said before, I think he's very aware of it and trying to make a big deal out of it early on. We have a little look at the action here. That was this uh, one of the flicks of the fight. Peter Yan throwing all he can at Magomedov. Here we see some nice clinch work. So tight, so back and forth. These guys are so well matched and so rapid in position to position. There is nothing between these two, and that's why it makes it such booster, red and black booster shots. Mag Magomed, when he lets them go, they are beautiful to watch. Very skilled, but you see how much he's evolved in all areas. The single just sucks him back and gets him up. Look Great at work. The balance Magomed. of Peter Yan, though. Very hard to keep on the ground. They've had to wait a full year to get back at it nicely. Magomed almost looks like he's questioning himself a little bit, the techniques he's going to throw. Hesitating a little. Nice overhand right. As well there. Wee, beautiful body shot. Really sitting down on that. Pulls it back into it. Look again at the balance, the hips of PTN. Under 20 seconds left in this second round, and, and now Yan looking, looking for that. Oh! Almost gets that takedown of his own. Magomed reverses it well and stands back. Yes, he was. Yeah, getting these grappling exchanges, I mean, in, in that case as well. I mean, really hard to tell who's winning this fight already. Very just Magomed's in charge of the grappling exchanges, but it doesn't get to anything that, of, of no. This is Magomed Magomedov for the 135. Following up with actually throwing it. Oh, there's some big shots from Peter Yan there. Built for this weight class. Nice little kick to a to a takedown entry there. Low kick trying to... Looks like Peter Yan's adjustment to trying to keep that distance now. Nice for work from Magomed. Three there, controlling the head, looking for a takedown of his own. We can see a big takedown. Look at that. Over commits to that takedown though and allows Magomed to get back up. I think a, a little bit somewhere and made the most of it. Nice, nil knee and looking for that sweep again, but it just ends on Magomed. Uh, MMA scene. And looking for that sweep again. Magomed of his knee on the way up. He's been dominant in this 135 pound division, but there can be the momentum shift just seems to be Whoa, his way. Look. Cartwheel kick there. <laughs> And we're going into the championship rounds, but here we get to see a little bit of that dirty boxing work I'm talking to beat. Throwing a few more shots, and here's the overcommit to this takedown. So dangerous in the scrambles as well. This was something I think surprised Magomedov in that first fight, that when he did get him down, bounce back up or throw up submission attempts. Extremely explosive. Magomed is just a technical genius. You know, for the way, and he's more of a cardio. We kick it off. This rematch is not... I think these are the rounds that count now. We've got two rounds that lie ahead of us. Just feel like the momentum shifting right now for Paddy Ann with these beautiful... And it's just there in that range. Th this range here where he's... Nice low kick from there. Magomedov and then goes back in attempting to get hold of Paddy Ann, close that distance. And that's just the difference in this range. Again, another, another thwarted takedown attempt.
in that clinch. Watch for the elbows of Petty Yannick. He's just relentless, non-stop. I mean, they cause himself no mercy for a reason. He just keeps coming. This time it's Yan that goes in. Yeah, yeah. again. But Needs to watch that crescendo it... from Magomed. It's deep. This very is... deep. This is how he finished out like Borisov. Oh, give him Petty Yan and he escapes. And listen to the crowds. And nearly cost Peter Yan. But there we go, a slam. Well, due to the mentality, you're in the fourth round. You just can't get the finish. And now Petty on the back. Yes. And both hooks. Not quite under the chin of Mahomet. Oh, Peter Yan drops the elbow. We have to watch the back of the head there, but they're back on. Seen opportunities had. Beautiful question mark kick there. Almost looked like a front kick and brought it up to the head. Just insane belief in himself, never quits. Yeah. Let's have a look here, this is where he went yeah. for the double leg. Beautiful entry, and like you said, he overcommits and lifts his head up. He is deep, deep, look how his wrist is underneath the neck. Guard all the way around, and he manages to escape, and then this beautiful belly-to-back takedown, and then we're here. Round. And it all cinched up. Yeah. He's on Paramount. Heart. This will be the 10th round these two have shared. That's way, that's way, for sure. <laughs> I've been using it a lot more in this fight than didn't last. Oi, beautiful body kick there. Switching up and going for the knee. Again, getting it up against the fence. Cage, three minutes 30 left of this. To make it, make it for him, it's all been Magomed. Three minutes left now. Nice stepping in elbow, followed by spinning elbows. They separate, we reset, and we go again. Work. And they said these are the championship rounds for a reason. Like you said, Magomed finds a way to win. Pushing himself here and coming into the fifth. He's laying it. Oy. Oh, big knee there as well. How did he not drop him with that knee? Be happy, whatever the judges say. We kind of want to see number three. Big breaths from both fighters now. Nice little elbow. Nice little... Exactly what's been put on in front of them here in Moscow. And that's the trip that Jan has used so effectively. The head letting him up. Knows there's only 10, 15 seconds left and he wants to make some... The crowd going crazy here for this amazing bout between these two men. People on their feet all around the arena. Wow. I feel like Petty Ann might have just taken that. I was saying, I know I said it already out loud. <laughs> but it's solid to be Petty Ann, so we get number three in the trilogy. Now with this, that rush. The judges are bringing back their scorecard. <laughs> Here we get to see some of that action. And it really was this distance for me, the clinching distance where Pityan took it. Adirshaw Padiedo, your winner by unanimous decision, and new back to reclaim what's his and that's ICB gold. No, я видел, что Ян это мужчина настоящий и по праву сегодня он этот пояс держит на себе. Я думаю, еще матч финал сохранится.